Settings and controls help you get the most out of your system with set it and forget it options or granular controls for the clean energy expert. In the system page, you'll learn about your devices and their performance. If you want to explore your system, tap on Know Your System, which will help you with all the latest topics, videos, and articles we post related to your system on our Enphase community. If you need help with your system, tap Site Details to see your installer's contact info. You can also change your home backup configuration and manage your connectivity. If you want to generate your system's report, tap on Reports. Select the type of report you want and set the parameters and click on the Email Report button. You will get the generated report sent on your registered email with Enphase. If you need to find information about a specific part of the system, tap Devices. To view each component's information, Tap each page to view the list of devices. For some, you can also change hardware settings here. If you have a storage system, you can access the live status from here too. In Live Vitals, you can access live detailed data of your IQ system controller and individual IQ batteries. If you want to look back at specific events, tap Event History to look at recorded system events and changes. Tap each event to view its details, like the start and end date, impacted device description, and recommended action. If you want to look at times when your system powered your home during an outage, tap Backup History to look at outage information. Navigate to the Settings page to adjust the controls of your Enphase system. If your Enphase Energy System has an IQ battery, tap Profile to select a profile that meets your primary energy goal. When enabled, StormGuard automatically monitors the severe weather conditions as per the local weather departments in your area. When detected, StormGuard switches your profile to full backup and charges your battery to 100% to help ensure your home stays powered. Choose your profile to help meet your energy goals. Savings Profile helps maximize savings on your electric bill by relying on the battery to power your home at times when electricity is more expensive. Setting up your electricity rate is needed to use this profile, but we'll cover that in the next section. Self-consumption aims to power your home with as much solar energy as possible by storing it in the batteries during the day and powering your home with it whenever the sun isn't shining. Full backup keeps you prepared by reserving 100% of the power in your battery for outages. Your batteries will charge from solar panels whenever they need to top off. Let's return to the settings page and click on battery to manage your battery settings. You can toggle this option to enabled if you want your batteries to charge from the grid whenever required as per your selected battery profile. You can also set up your battery shutdown level percentage. During a power outage, it will shut down your batteries when they reach a set charge percentage to conserve some energy which will help them to restart when the utility grid restores power or solar panels start producing energy. Add your electricity rate to use the savings profile and estimate the value of the energy you've produced. Tap electricity rate and then add electricity import rate. Use autofill or manual option to add your rate. Have your electric bill handy for both options. With Autofill, simply select your utility and tariff name or code. It might also be called a rate schedule or structure on your bill. Then select Next. Verify the information on the confirmation screen and save to complete. Once you've added your electricity import rate, follow the same steps to add your electricity export rate. Last, in the settings page, Grid Control lets you turn your connection to the grid on and off. This is an advanced feature, so we don't recommend using it often. To toggle your grid connection, complete the verification process by entering a four-digit code we'll send via email and text to the phone and email connected to the account. Once verified, your system will disconnect or reconnect to the grid.